Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another chillax session with Hakuna Lemisa. So today's topic would be about how to uh, how to make your period come faster. So from my experience, it's like um period uh period if it don't come during the time where you want or when you plan, it's actually a very nuisance thing. Uh, especially if you are planning to go on a trip or something like that. Like for me, like uh, I personally have this problem where my period don't come on time. It usually come either earlier few days or maybe it will drag after a few days. So it's actually very uh, very hard for me to calculate um, to plan ahead of time when I want to go for a vacation or when I need to do something like swimming activities or, or anything like that. So um I, I like for example let's say if you need to go on trip on the seventeenth and then so that means your period need to come on the tenth so that uh you have seven days then on seventeen itself or uh, you need to come on the nine actually. So on the seventeen itself you are totally safe from period, you don't need to ha- care about all the um all the hassle of bringing a pet and all those other problems. So today um i'm sure that out of i'm sure that out there there's a lot of girls who are facing the same problem as me because uh apparently this is quite common that a lot of girls um they can't have their period on time so these are a few ways that i personally uh use to speed up my period pro- uh to speed up my pre- uh, period from coming so one of the first way that I always use is actually reflexology so reflexology actually have um two point where you can uh, apply pressure to so that your blood maybe your blood circulation will go better and everything so it will help you to um t- uh, to trigger your period actually so the first one is um at your wrist so you can see at your wrist here in between your wrist there's a deep you can feel like there's a hole in between like uh in between the two what is this the two bones you can feel that there's a dip over here so you just uh, touch the dip over here at the two side so the first side where is that uh, your thumb here underneath your thumb here at the wrist area here this is your um uterus area and then this is your ovary uh, ovary area for the for your another side so you just apply pressure at both sides and then you just go in circle it's like a massage so you just um, apply some pressure to it don't need to be too hard and don't be too soft also because it won't touch the point so you just massage clockwise anti-clockwise any way you like so uh, maybe like for a few minutes five ten minutes and uh, you can do it anywhere actually during you watch movie or when you're just sitting doing nothing so you can just um, do it a few days and then you 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 will see that your period is start you feel that your period is starting to come already so another place is which i highly recommend for you to press uh, press the pressure point rather than your hand is actually in between your is uh, your leg pressure point so i can't show you my leg so i'll show you using my hand okay so this is my leg okay this is my leg and then that's this is my feet okay the bottom of my feet so um you can see um in between the heels and the ankle there's actually a pressure point in between the heels and the ankle so the inner part is uh the inner part is the uh, uterus area and the outer part is the ovary area so you just use your knuckle just use like two knuckle like that and then you just um and be in between the pressure point you can feel the pressure point um, between your heels and your your heels and your uh, ankle so you just go like a massage um doing the at the pressure point there i uh, don't need to be too hard but uh, don't be too soft or so then you can just do it clockwise anti-clockwise so uh, one side um both side of course are uh, the inside part and the outside part of your leg also so do it for both of your leg and then it's also same you can do it like a few minutes or so and i personally find that the leg massage the leg, leg, leg reflexology is actually more useful uh, than the hand reflexology i don't know why maybe because uh, there the, the vein is bigger or something like that i'm not sure why but it actually really do work so i personally try it out so during my uni days i i really have a problem to come pe- uh, to to come period on time and you know uni we have a lot of uh, things going on so I want my period to be on time as as on time as possible 
So I, I was panicking because I think like uh, two months maybe my period was not here yet. So I was like, Ugh, if it's, it's not coming again, maybe I have some problems, uh, my uterus, maybe I'm sick and all. So I started to search online, then I searched for this reflexology and for some reason it really did work, okay. Right uh, right after I started the, fr- the foot, my leg reflexology by myself, I think I massaged for like five minutes and then I really feel like that's a there's a pain in my tummy so I went to the toilet and checked it's like and yeah it's, it's, it's here so this is the first way and the second way um, where I find is useful um, which is taught by my friends my Chinese friend so she taught me to eat red dates you know Chinese have many kind of red dates they have the big kind medium kind and the small kind so you can get those like a medium kind it's, uh, it's red dates actually it tastes very sweet actually but uh, for for me when I take it, when I take it first time because I'm not the kind of people who like to eat all the Chinese herbs and everything so it's quite difficult for me but um it's actually good because it actually help you to give blood to you it's like help to what the Chinese say push yeah so eating red dates can actually help to um give you give your body blood okay so one day you can eat like three three um because it's like one one bg one bg like that one is like. Uh, so you can take like three bg per day uh, or if you don't want to eat it itself and there's a seed in the center don't eat the seed so if you don't like to eat it you can even boil uh, boil it to make it a soup something like a dessert soup like that and you can drink it but i personally prefer eating it because it's less nuisance and also uh, i don't really and i enjoy the taste a lot but it actually tastes not bad after trying it for a few months so you can just eat it or if you want to make it easier you can just drink it so that's the second way that's a good way also and the price is not very expensive if you buy the medium type one if you want to buy the expensive the the big kind of red dates and that one would be very expensive so it depends on you which kind you would like and then the third way is actually which I also usually use with the red date because I don't take red dates every day because I feel like red dates um, is sweet so I'm scared that it will be too heaty for me. So you know Chinese we always say uh, rochi rochi so I'm scared that it's too heaty and everything so I also would take it together with vitamin C. So citrus fruit, vitamin C or um, those citrus fruit, lemon, orange, they actually help to trigger your hormones so that your period can come f- uh, will, will, be, will come faster. So uh, you can either eat uh, uh, um, fruits or I personally just prefer getting vitamin C. So I will uh, actually take those, uh, what they one called, the effervescent, the one that can can put inside the water then just pss, then you just drink it yeah the 1000 mg that kind one you can take any brand that you want okay so you just put it in cold water and then you just drink it it actually helps to speed up also and if you don't want to take vitamin c or red dates i, I take it alternatively like maybe today i take red dates then tomorrow i take uh, vitamin c and then uh, another way is actually pineapple so i don't know um whether you guys know this or not but actually pineapple is a tropical fruit too and it actually can help to trigger your period too so you can either choose to eat pineapple usually i would eat pizza then on pizza they have pineapple because i don't usually like pineapple by itself but for the sake of my period i would go and eat it so you can order pizza on pizza they have the pineapple right usually i would take just pick it out and just throw it i'm not a pineapple fan so if you want your period to come faster you can eat the 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 pineapple on the pizza uh, either way the fastest way is uh, you can uh, go to a shop and then you tell them you want pineapple juice okay you tell them no sugar and no other thing added just pineapple juice itself so mostly they are then you tell them uh, you don't want ice so you just want pineapple juice and then maybe sometime they will add with some warm water i think to make it uh to make it more diluted so you can have that also. So what I usually do is I take red dates and then uh, maybe at night time I get pineapple juice. And then the next day I take vitamin C and then with massage. Uh, massage as in reflexology. So these are the four things that you can do to make to speed up your, your period uh, process. Uh, not process, to, to make your period come faster actually. And then the another thing that my friend taught me quite interesting i never really use it but my friend said it work is by soaking your leg into warm water like every night you just take some warm water and then you just soak your leg inside the warm water for a few minutes then um 
um, you can add a little bit of vinegar, white vinegar into it also and it's good for blood, circula uh, blood circulation so it helps to trigger your period too and the last way that I search online a lot is um, you can do some exercise and some yoga exercise as in um, jogging they say jogging is good to induce your period too or you can even do some yoga position certain yoga position it um, applies some force uh, or pressure to your lower lower body which actually help to trigger your period too so these are the few ways that you can try if you are having problem like me to have my period come on time or you're planning for a trip and you want your period to come sooner as possible so these are the few ways so uh, just to conclude up one number one is you can do reflexology on your hand on your leg number two is you can take red dates number three take vitamin c number four take a pineapple or pineapple juice number five you can do um soak your leg in warm water uh, yeah, temperature is up to you with vinegar and number six is you can exercise jogging and number seven is uh, number seven is some yoga position do some yoga and this seven trick if you do all finish this seven trick i'm sure that your period will come um, sometime it will come immediately after you do so it works wonders so it's uh, up to your body so it depends on your body and if you guys have give it a try i hope you guys can share in the comment below whether it works for you whether it doesn't or do you have any other trick to help speed up your period from coming so anyway this is the end of today's chillax session so thank you so much and goodbye